what's up everybody it's your girl brooklyn stacy and welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to be showing you how to make your own burdock root powder it's very simple it just it's very simple very easy very quick um, and i use it all the time i put burdock root in my smoothies so let's get a closer look at showing you how the burdock root looks and you can get this at your health food store. You can get this online. Uh, burdock root is everywhere. And so as you can see, it's actually a bark. I mean, it is very dense, it's very solid. It is a root. So um, that is exactly uh, what it is. And so, like I said, you can get the powdered form or you can just you know, opt to go ahead and, and grind it up yourself. Now, I've already ground some up. I have my uh, grinder. I just picked this up at a local thrift store and it, it's dusty looking because I've already used it and had some burdock root that I put in the smoothie that I used uh, this morning my sea moss smoothie all right so let's get it and also uh, just to let you know this is uh, what I usually keep it in when I do it in batches you want to get it into a mason jar where you can actually seal it and uh, keep it fresh all right and we're going to just actually just put it on in our grinder here with of course clean hands i mean i'm in my kitchen and it is for me so when you do it you do it your way um you can actually you know put it on something in a, a, a towel you can actually put it on something and just you know just scoop it like for instance this is what it came in so for all intents and purposes you can just scoop it on that way and get it in whichever way you want to get it in as long as you get it all in doesn't matter all right and so we have that in there and I'll show you what that looks like like I said it's just a simple grinder and we'll just put the, the top on it and we'll just pulse it so I've already ground this up for about 30 to 60 seconds somewhere around in there and I just wanted to uh, show you just to check it and see how it has been doing. So let's just go ahead and tap some of that powder because sometimes when you open it, you know, the powder is everywhere. So let's see. Alright, so as you can see, you know, it's still a uh, it's still a bit of solid pieces, little small solid pieces in there that we want to get ground up. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and pulse it just for a few more seconds. It's pretty much ready, but I just want to get it a fine powder. And again, that's totally up to you and um, your liking. But my suggestion, just go ahead and grind it up a few more seconds. All right, seems like it's ready. As you can see, you can see the, the fine powder uh, settling there on the top. I'm just gonna again, tap it down and make sure we get as much of the powder off of the top so that when we take it out, it doesn't go everywhere. See how the powder comes everywhere. So um, it's pretty much uh, ground up really good at this point. It's a, a, a nice fine powder, no more chunks and hunks in there. All the bark, all the root is nicely ground up. So um, the only thing left to do is just to transfer it in a container um, that you want, uh, whether it is the actual mason jar, whether it's a plastic 
uh, type of bowl with a seal, whether it is a Ziploc bag, just something that will keep it airtight. All right, I'm just going to transfer it manually without using my funnel and without making a complete mess. <laughs> so that's all it is to it. Just transfer it into uh, the mason uh, jar or your receptacle, your container of choice, your Ziploc bag, something airtight. And uh, just, you know, you have to tap and make sure you get all the fine particles out uh, from the grinder. And then you can just simply scoop that in there like so. And there you have it. I didn't make too much of a mess. Like I said, if I had my funnel, it would be better. I would suggest you get a funnel for this, just for the transfer. So that's it guys. There is your burdock root. And normally I would have a bit more, but since I this is the last of it, I just wanted to show you how I would do it. But I would fill it up, of course, a, a, a bit more because I would have a bit more. Make sure that you like, share, and subscribe uh, to the channel. Do share this. You know, there may be some other people that want to know how simple it is. Some people think it's really difficult, but it's not difficult at all. So do hit the share button. Do hit the like button. And subscribe to the channel so you can watch some of the other videos that I have and the variety of videos that I planned to do. This is a lifestyle channel, so it will be about health and wellness. It may be about fashion. It may be about entertainment and travel. So thank you for watching. As always, take care and be well. Bye-bye.